I'm gonna just put it on a spatula and see how it do. What's up, y'all? What's popping? Okay, I was the intro. I was just fuck me up. Uh, so but anyway, today I'm going to be cooking, y'all. I'm not gonna lie, I can't really cook. I can cook a little bit, but I can't really cook like that. Damn, this camera heavy. It hurt my arm. So today I'm gonna do some. Um, turn the camera around. I'm gonna do some stew. I'm gonna do some vegetarian stew, vegan stew, whatever you wanna call it, because I think this is pretty much vegan. I read the instructions. And then I'm gonna do some hot water cornbread. I don't know if y'all know about that hot water cornbread. That's something from the south. Hot water cornbread. So I'm gonna try to do that. I never made hot water cornbread. The stew simple. Cut the potatoes, put the chicken in there, do it. Easy. But the hot water cornbread, I ain't never really did that before. So we're gonna see how it is, and I don't know how it's gonna look on. Huh, I don't know, but I'm gonna try it. Okay, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna cut my potatoes up. Boom, these are chopped. You got your seasoning, you got your spaghetti sauce, and your vegetables. So you're gonna pull your vegetables in there. Pull that in there. Put your potatoes in there. Pull the salt. Uh, I don't know what this is, y'all, but it tastes good. Oh, it tastes good. Put a little bit of that in there. Yeah. You know you, and then you know you got to put your lard and lard in there, cause it ain't lard. Okay. Okay, just put it in there. Put your lard in there. Yeah. All right. So then you're gonna put your progressive. Like I said, people probably like, this is not how I do my. Girl, I don't care about your stool. This is my stool. And put your uh progression. Progress. Put your prego. Put your prego. Prego in there. Throw that thing in there. So then you're gonna just mix that thing up. Oh, and then don't forget, put your little pepper in there too. Put your little, little pepper. Don't put too much, cause you know pepper make it cough. So now you're just gonna put your top on it and let that set. You're gonna let it set a little bit, you know, cook. The potatoes and stuff gonna cook. So don't worry about your potatoes, it's gonna cook. So we, now we're gonna get started on our, um, uh, hot water cornbread. I'm gonna be real, I ain't never in my life made hot water cornbread, so. We'll see how this go. Don't judge me if I mess it up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put this on the back burner where I can put my hot water cornbread up here. Um, don't even judge me on this too hard, y'all. I'm gonna just put it on the spatula and see how it do. Ah! Oh! Look, this is rough. I burned myself. I'm already bruised all up. Hmm. Come on, they falling apart. They looking a mess. I hope they. Oh, that's hot. Ooh! Everything hot. I'm gonna stir this stew up. At least this will be good, I hope. I bet y'all like, boy, you cannot cook. I swear I can cook a little bit. This whole up burned. I tried. Ooh, what's up, y'all? What's poppin'? I know I look rough. I know I look... We in quarantine. Look, the barbershop's not it. And y'all see my hair growing, though. Hold up. I ain't, I ain't brushed it today, either. Don't judge me. And I can't put my contacts on, because uh, I was doing a TikTok. I was doing a TikTok, and let me just show you what happened. So yeah, anyway, so my eyes hurt from that, so I can't put my contacts in, and I'm about to go cut this herb off. I bet that herb is all in the background. I'm gonna burn up for a minute. I'm about to hit this park and go exercise. It is um, 94 degrees out here. I might pass out, it's so hot. Oh, I'm, uh, I'm procrastination in it. I don't wanna do it. Oh my god. I can't run. I tried to run it. <sighs> Ain't ready for that yet, but progress is progress. So let's get it. So I finished my little walk a walk. That's about a good three, two, two, three. I don't really know. But look how hot it is. My little thing don't even melt. Can y'all see that? It'll melt. That's how hot it is. God. I say <clears throat> I gotta get my life right because. Oh, I can't, I can't, I can't do heat. I gotta get my life right. I gotta do better. I gotta do better, cause heat is not for me, Jesus. I'm hungry, I gotta give me something to eat. Uh, no thank you, can I get the number uh, 21? With a, with an orange juice? Okay. And that'll be all? Okay, 21 with orange juice, okay, you're shout out at 724, thank you. Thank you. Look at God. Mm. 
Mmm. Mmm. Shit. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Jack in the motherfucking box. You had to eat yourself, ho. Mmm. Mmm. My God. Anyway, I got my yoga land. Make sure I like my dough. Beautiful. <laughs> that pink berry is good. It's the simple things, man. The simple things. Pink berry with a nice view. The simple things. You know, I do that a lot. Just sit and reflect and just try to listen and try to hear from God because I feel like sometimes I get in the way of God because sometimes I try to do things myself. I'm learning that like what God has for you is for you regardless of what, you know, just stay focused and keep grinding and um, never compromise yourself for, you know, people or like for social media because it like on social media make it seems like everything is okay and that everybody's living a perfect life which is not even the situation so just learning to just be grateful and then that my time is coming just keep grinding and stay focused and never lose who I am in the process of everything and stop looking at everybody else's life and comparing myself to everybody else's because sometimes you feel like God has kind of forgotten about you which is not even the case you know sometimes God is just protecting you because it's not your time in the meantime he's protecting you and so I'm just learning it and learning to be patient and just like the little simple things in life you know I enjoy those and yeah I love that and I hope y'all take something from that too you know what God has is for you and can't nobody take that away from you.